Hey everybody out there, how is it going this morning? Or this afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are. It's this morning for me. Um, I had a meet up with Pipe Pappy yesterday. Oh Chris, uh, we met up at a uh, local B&M and had us a bowl or three or something like that. And uh, my, when you have a meet up like that, you don't realize that you look at your watch in a few minutes and it's four hours later. So we had a good time. I enjoyed it. So, uh, if there's anybody in the Oklahoma area, in the greater Tulsa area, you want to do that, we should do it more often. And so, uh, if we can find other guys out there. But, main reason for the video, when I met with Chris, he brought me, of course that lighting is very terrible, but he brought me a box of goodies. A floating box of goodies. So I'm going to do a very quick yabo. I am not going to go through every single tobacco one by one and smell every single one. Uh, we've all seen the videos. Uh, and this is a kind of a large box. So I'm, <coughs> I'm sitting here in my pickup again. And uh, well, if I can get under this tape. And I'll set it over here in the seat beside me and we'll pull some of the goodies out and see what we got. All right, got it broke open there. And pulling all the bubble wrap and packing and newspaper out. There's a box of cigars. I will not take the time to go through that. Some snuff and some snuff. I am not a snuff taker. I've been talking to Ben and trying to learn some about it. I'm just, I'm not sure I'm quite there, ready for it, so I am gonna pass on the snuff. Um, I'm gonna set that back there and here. Is this what you call a bob? Sorry about the sun, guys. I'm trying to get the best angle I can to where it works for my face and everything. This is a big old bag of backy. bunch of names and addresses that have been crossed out so it looks like it's gone to all of those guys there's the note in there hello my fellow pipe smokers it's your boy Jaime Oliva Jr. so here are my requests for the floating box of goodies please be thoughtful of others when taking from the box uh, if you would like to add to this floating box of goodies feel free to do so also please do not hold on to the box for more than three days please contact the next person uh, to receive the box with the tracking number after you ship it to them. And then I will contact you with a name and address to send the box of goodies to. If the box has no more destinations, please contact me so it may come back to me. Do a video of the box opening. Thanks for your participation and honesty. Peace. And then uh, don't keep the snuff, only sample. I'm neither going to keep nor sample it. I may at some point, I'm just... <clears throat> not, not ready for it yet. I don't want to, you know, cry all over camera yet. And so, by the way, I did message uh, Jaime back and forth last night, and there are no more destinations, so I will get it shipped back to, <clears throat> excuse me, back to him uh, today. And so, and I am telling you, there is, of course, you've probably seen all the videos of all the different uh, tobacco's in here. Here is a blend full of random shit. That might be interesting to try. You know what? You know what? That smells like crap. Not really. That's for you, Pipe Pappy. That's kind of an inside joke with uh some pins ants i mean and again i'm not going to go through hell's kitchen i'm not going to go through every single one of these but i just want to kind of look at some of them here there's some for just from him. oh the zombie blend that's from just for him a blend from them a zombie blend i got to try some of the zombie blend uh some have you heard of this blend rehydrate me Stonehaven, it must be kind of dry, so I'll have to get a little, I'll have to get a bowl of that out and and uh, get a little bit of moisture to it. McClelland 
Orient 996 from 2009. Somebody's had that sitting around. Of course, we've got Pipe Pappy showed a bunch of these guys. Again, sorry for the lighting. Um, cherry Bon Bon. I haven't had anything cherry yet, so I'll have to try some of that. Early Morning Pipe. That's one I've been wanting to try. That one I cannot read. The only word I can read on this bag is blend. <laughs> I don't know whether that's a home blend, whether that's... I'm not for sure what that is. So anyway. Oh, well, here's a mystery blend that burns hot. So that's it. I mean, there are still tons of baggies in here. Uh, I can, I'm not going to make a 15-minute video going through this, smelling everyone. Um, we don't have smell-o-vision yet, so you guys can't smell it. So I will go through this. I'll get it on the way back to you, Jaime, today. Um, and again, I'm not going to try the snuff. I've... What's... Hold on a minute. What's this in this bag? Of, why? Answer me this. Why is there a tin of snuff in here? That doesn't have a lid on it. I'm just kidding. That's another inside joke for somebody. So anyway, I've got this. I will go through it. I will add, because I was going through some of my uh, stuff last night. I was telling Pipe Pappy, I felt kind of bad about pulling samples out of the box, because I didn't have a whole lot to add to it. But I was going through my stuff last night, and it's like, you know what, I've got, and I haven't gone through everything in here yet to see, but as long as I don't replicate, I've got six different blends that I've got enough to put in there. And so uh, I'll go through that. I'll send this on the way back. Thanks for letting me be a part of it. I enjoyed it. It was fun. So I'll go through this, pull out some, uh, do all the smell test, and uh, get it back on the way. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.